All right, here are solutions to 25 off the GRE subject, uh, math, practice, exam. Uh, kind of weird problem or weird placement of this problem. Uh, it seems to be getting harder and harder as you go through this practice exam. And then 25, I mean, at the risk of sounding condescending, is pretty easy. I guess kind of definitional. If you know what these words mean, it's really quick and easy. Uh, so what's going on here is that you have the graph of the derivative. So be careful, this ain't the function. This is the derivative of the function. Um, and which of the following open intervals contain an inflection point? In other words, find the inflection point of the function h. Not of this guy, but of the function h. So, okay, inflection point of h means h double prime changes sign. Changes from positive to negative or negative to positive. Uh, but that's equivalent to saying h prime changes uh, from increasing to decreasing or decreasing to increasing. Why are those the same? Because h double prime is the derivative of h prime. So if this thing, if the derivative of this thing changes between positive or negative, then this thing is changing between increasing and decreasing. So really all I gotta do is look at this picture and figure out when does it switch from increasing to decreasing or decreasing to increasing. Bam, done, right here. That's it. It's decreasing and now it's increasing. The rate at which it increases changes a little bit. You got this sharp change here, but don't let that throw you off. It was increasing, it's still increasing. It doesn't matter, it's increasing. The only spot where it changes from increasing to decreasing is this guy right here. So where is this guy? I don't know, negative one and a half or so. In other words, it's a point in this interval right here. That's your answer. Hey, told you it was easy.